What's good? It's Shigozi. It's Tuesday, November 13th, 2018. And I have some very good propaganda. I think people are going to enjoy this because people want to know more about Meghan Markle and the propaganda she participates in. They want to know more about the royal family. And of all the royal family information, once you apply gematria numerology, then their information actually becomes entertaining. It actually becomes worth wanting to watch and follow. Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton wear black to attend Remembrance Day service. I mean, come on, people. And I like how a decent number of people saw my last video about Theresa Mary May wearing purple on November 8th, representing 88, Elizabeth 88, purple 88. So then they're on their way to the Armistice Day ceremony. That's why the convoy thing happened. And then at the ceremony, then now they're talking about Kate Middleton and Mary, Meghan Markle are wearing black, you know, funeral co colors to attend the Remembrance Day service. This is foreshadowing the Queen's very near imminent death. We just had the King of Comic Books be murdered, Stan Lee. So we're gonna have the Queen of Theatrical Acting in the UK, the Queen of England. Elizabeth II dies soon. So I really would like to thank people giving me some information here. Here's Sandy Brown. She noticed the queen coronated was in her coronation in 1953, Britain equals 53. And then Theresa May begged the EU to give her some respect on September 21st, two weeks and six days before her birthday, Queen 26. You know that they're mocking you. Anyone watching this who's new to this, I'm letting you know they're mocking you. That they're paralleling the Queen with Theresa May so much because Theresa May is the Queen of England, essentially. To me, she's no different. And it's not even just to me. The Queen of England, Theresa May, are no different. They are both actors for the federal government, for this one world order, Zionist Jew cabal. So we have the queen here wearing purple. See? At the Armistice Day Remembrance Service. Wearing purple, Elizabeth 88. And then also, I would like to thank Juan Stewart and Jean telling me that the flowers are poppy. You know, I learned much from you too, Jean. And then Juan Stewart continues. It's definitely a poppy. They are sold here in the UK as Armistice Day approaches. People wear them to show respect for those that died during the wars. As for number 10, because remember on Theresa May's Twitter, they have that 10. And I was like, all oh, this 10 I'm seeing. And yeah, after seeing that, I was like, oh shit, 10 Downing Street. And then he reminds me. That's as in 10 Downing Street is the equivalent of your White House. Thanks for the decode. Well, thanks for this information, Stuart. You know, 10 Downing Street. That's what I'm saying. They're on 10 Downing Street, which is just one. And they can put that number all up and down their propaganda. It's all about the numbers with this gang. 1039, Federal 39. That's what I'm saying. It's the federal government. I hope if you're in UK, you never have anyone tell you that, <laughs> that UK is not a federal government. Because just because in school they teach you that, I'm telling you the truth. UK is a federal government, it is part of this one world order. Zionist Jew Network. So let's get into the propaganda. So Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton were black to attend Remembrance Day service. Posted at 9.44. See? Posted at 9.44. Might be a little bit too small here, but we'll open the propaganda up. It's here too. Whoops. Oh, that's more, uh, you see how propaganda that is. You know, you see Huffington Post, you see a very fat person. Just to let you know what type of propaganda that is. So, here at 9.44 a.m., they update this propaganda. They publish the propaganda. Kill equals 44. Here with Meghan Markle 
Prince Harry. These are two actors for the federal government. She was literally in suits. I mean, that's what I'm saying. And they to confuse you, they say she's a retired actor. Notice how they don't call Donald Trump a retired actor. Because well, none of these people are retired. So also look at the video length. 107. Kill 17. 107, the 28th crime. Kill 28. We'll look at the notes first because there's more here I saw. You know, of course, they changed the video and the propaganda. When I saw it early today, it was perfect. And I put this together. So we'll just go through this while we're still early in the video before anyone leaves prematurely. So kill equals 44. 944 was posted. And look, you even have the, the three actors, the queen in the middle. Look at this, the queen wearing black. They're all wearing poppies. Poppy equals 88, 34. They're literally wearing poppies to symbolize the murder of Elizabeth. So this has been an Armistice Day thing for some time. Like I'm not just making this up, but I'm saying this particular Armistice Day, they're sick. Because there's been Armistice Day every year, but I don't remember as much propaganda about it. I don't remember them showing all these pictures, you know, Kate Middleton and Meghan Markle wearing poppies, wearing black with the queen, Elizabeth 8843, poppy 883447, Elizabeth also equals 47. It's the same things. And 155, poppy equals 11, 1 plus 5 plus 5 is 11. I mean, I really think people need to see what's going on in this world. You're living out a agenda. You're living out a script. A bunch of actors. I can't believe this. It's just, I'm already talking about the ritual that they were doing, and then we get propaganda on that day all about this. Look at the video length. 46 seconds. Forty six second video. The word sacrifice equals forty six. Chaos forty six. So not only do we get the symbolism, we get the gematria. Sacrifice forty six, forty six second video published at nine forty four, kill forty four, execution forty four. You know, poppy Elizabeth. It's also a red poppy. That's how they call it in the propaganda, a red poppy. One oh one, the twenty six prime number. Queen equals 26. You know, Sandy Brown telling us the Theresa May, two and six, two months, six days from her birthday, saying, have some respect for me. No, don't respect Theresa May because she is an actor. Respect is reciprocal. She doesn't respect you. She wants you to believe that there's Islamic boogeyman going around. Blowing people up, shooting people, stabbing people. So here we go. And do you see what this propaganda is on the surface? And this is why I love people. This is on my phone. Someone just left a comment. I forgot. I just glimpsed at it. But they're saying, you know, thanks about the whole the phone thing. I was telling them how you can go on your phone and you can have on, this, like on your Android, you can have a stream of propaganda. You can choose which news outlet you want. And I recently added People Magazine. One of the best things I've ever done in my career doing this. Because People is, if you're, if you're not from America, People Magazine is federal government propaganda. It equals 33 and 93, like propaganda. And it's just a bunch of celebrity stuff. It's like, you know, whose dress is good? Who is doing what? Who's dating who? It's kind of, It's like the National Enquirer, but more toned down. And here, we're looking at this, and they're telling us, you know, whose dress is, is the best. And this is the best part. Look at, what, look at what Kate's wearing. Meanwhile, Kate sported a black Alexander McQueen coat. See? Alexander McQueen coat. This is about the Queen's impending death. They're all wearing black at this thing. It's a Remembrance Day. Poppy synced up with Elizabeth. She's wearing purple there. All these death numbers. And then she's wearing an Alexander McQueen coat. Kate Middleton is. The, the actor on the right. 
That's Meghan Markle right here. You know, her mom, Donna Raglan, her Darla Raglan, whatever, racist names. These are coded actors. So we're 10 minutes in. I like where we're at. Let's keep going through the notes. But I'm just trying to emphasize the ritual. You know, I, I do a lot of this talking and showing the things, the pictures, and explaining a lot for the people that are new, for the people that need more than just the numbers or want more than just the numbers, you know, that can even understand the numbers but want more context. I mean, I can't believe she's wearing an Alexander McQueen coat. Well, I can, but it's like, can this riddle be any more, any more clear? <laughs> These people. The royal family is just a theater troupe. <laughs> the queen is just an actor. <laughs> and Meghan Markle. And this German actor. German president Frank Walter Steimer's wife. So she's the first lady of Germany. Elk, Elke Bunenbender. So there, she's Germany's version of Melania Trump. You know, it's another theatrical actor for the federal government. Another masculine looking actor for this gang. Megan, Duchess of Sussex. Oh man, this is the best part of the video. I can't believe I took so long to get here. So this is how Austin knows this is for the Queen's murder. Are you are you ready? We're gonna go through this real quick, and we'll all see what's going on. So Megan, Megan Markle, Rachel Megan Markle, born August fourth, nineteen eighty one. Right now she's thirty seven years old. Queen equals seventy three. From her birthday, which is the same birthday as Obama, to Armistice Day, three months, seven days. Queen, 73. But it's also a span of three months, eight days. Murder, 38. So, so you see how three months, eight days later, and then 38 weeks from her upcoming birthday. From her upcoming 38th birthday, she's going to be 38 next year. So 38 weeks from her upcoming 38th birthday, she's at the Remembrance Day, Death 38, Killing 38, Murder 38, R.I.P. equals 38. And here we have Meghan Markle then, 38 from her birthday, participating in this propaganda. So I showed you all the pictures, and, and that's the thing. A lot of other YouTube channels that don't put on Gematria, they will show you those pictures. They might have said the same thing. But they wouldn't have showed you the Gematri band poppy, and they wouldn't show you the numerology from the birthday. And we see the same gang, again, Sandra Bullock, just another actor for the Zionist Jews. Sandra Bullock, Meghan Markle, the Queen of England are absolutely no different. There's absolutely no difference between them at all. Maybe you can say the Queen has royal blood, but who knows? Sandra Bullock probably does too. Sandra Bullock equals 83 reversed in alphabetical order, like murder. 8338, C8338, murder by numbers. Look, the E is a three, the B is an eight. Why do they do this? We all know Hollywood's run by the Zionist Jew cabal, the Freemasons. This is Kabbalah, a form of Jewish mysticism. See it right here. So it's not hard to see what's going on. We have plenty of examples. And then we see it here from the birthday of Meghan Markle. So look, Catherine. Catherine right here, Duchess of Cambridge. Kate Middleton is just a theatrical actor playing the role of the Duchess of Cambridge. I am saying this again and again. You have to understand, the royal family is a theatrical performance troupe. All they do is perform and participate in scripted, predetermined, contrived propaganda from this One World Order federal government. So she's 36 right now. Look at this. From her birthday, her 36th birthday, to this Armistice Day ceremony, 307 days. Just like how Meghan Markle was the 37, you know, the reflection of 73, Queen 73. And then look. Eight weeks, three days from her upcoming 37th birthday. So she's going to be 37, again, Queen 37. Eight weeks, three days from Kate Middleton's upcoming 37th birthday. Just like how Death 38, Meghan Markle, from three and eight, from her upcoming 38th birthday, or 38 weeks, it was 38 weeks. 
So 30 weeks from Meghan Markle's birthday, eight weeks, three days from Kate Middleton's birthday. How is this a coincidence? This is not coincidence at all. This is called murder by numbers. This is called predictive programming. I am exposing the royal family again as a theatrical performing artist troupe. That is exactly what they are. I'm not making a metaphor. That's all they are. That's by definition what they are. That's all they've ever done. Participate and act in Freemason propaganda. Kill equals 59. 59 is the 17th prime. Kill also equals 17. 59 days from Kate Milton's upcoming birthday. She is participating in this propaganda. Also, it's a span of 60 days. Death 60. One month, 30 days. 13. Eight weeks, four days. It's 84. Masonry, Zionism. Meghan Markle born 8 slash 4. Obama equals 84. So there you go. I think in the last five minutes of this, we saw this very good part. This is a nice video. You know, I always want to do more, but I just want to keep this just like this. I want people to see what I saw today. Oh, I did actually want to do, I was going to do this. We could do Camila, Duchess of Cornwall. We might do her later. I want to see German president Frank Walter Steimer's wife, Elke Bundenbender. I want to see, if, if you're German, you know, Barney Yumman, if you're watching, or anyone else German, if you can translate her name, I would like to know what Bundenbender means. If, if you know, I mean, you might not, it might not have a meaning. That's obvious. I don't know, but I just want to know. But uh, let's look at her. Let's look at her birthday to when she's there. Because I was wondering why she's there. guys. It can be anybody. I've I always profess my ignorance here. I've never heard of Elke Bundenbender in my entire life. In my 27 years of being alive, I've never heard of her. I can tell you right now, though, she is a theatrical actor for the federal government. Oh, absolutely, stage performer. Look at this deceiver. I mean, her message could be good, I don't know, but it doesn't matter. She's participating in false flag theater by the numbers. Elke Budenbender. I mean, her name's fun to say. I'm probably saying it wrong. Bunden. See, I'm, it's not Bunden, it's Buden. I know if you do Bundenbender or Bunda or something, it's like Bunda, like federal. Or word for federal. 64, like Synagogue of Satan, 80. 1270, 31st Prime. Scottish Rider Freemasonry, 127. But January 14th to Remembrance Day. Let's see that. Remembrance Day is Veterans Day in America. It's the same thing. The same, you know, remembering tyranny, remembering people deceiving you, selling you out. It's the same bullshit. World War equals 114. <laughs> I don't think it's any coincidence that the German first lady has World War numbers in her birthday. So it's her upcoming birthday. How old is she now? She's 56. Society of Jesus, 56. So to her upcoming 40, uh, 57th birthday, let's see Elke Bunenbender. How many days? 64 days. Her name. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? She is an actor for the federal government, for the Freemasons, the Catholic Church, Catholic 46. Her name sums to 64. <laughs> 64 days from her birthday. She's at that ceremony. Those are two months, three days, 23 to 9th prime, nine weeks, one day. Nine weeks, one day. The sum of numbers 1 through 13 equals 91. You know, very spectacular. K is the 11th letter, so you don't need to reduce it. So it also sums to 73, a sacrifice number. Kill 64, sacrifice 73, and that's why she's there. Elk, you know, 33. I mean, come on. She's a, an actor for the Freemasons. Budenbender, 49, 203. Bundenbender 203. She's there. Two months, three days. Unbelievable. And I start off with saying I've never heard of her in my entire life. You see how I can show you, though, how using this numerological practice, she is a 
stage performer. She is a performing artist for the Freemasons. Born January 14th, 1962. Probably some Freemasonic numbers here. Mason, 62. <laughs> Elkie, 33. Born date with a lifeless number, 33. Freemason, 96. Masonry, 33. I just said there's going to be Freemason numbers here. Born date with 24 numerology. This is two months, four days from her birthday. Unbelievable. Born to be from the, by the Freemasons. She's born to this network. Her, I'm sure her dad is a Freemason. Freemason 96. She has sometimes been referred to by the media as First Lady. Because, so I guess First Lady is an American. Oh, it's not an American. Why, why are they, I don't know why they're doing this. Is she not the First Lady? And she is. I don't get this. It's probably some Gematria riddle. It's probably some riddle. That's why they're doing this. I'm saying. So, okay, born, <laughs> born January 14th, and they're syncing us up from her upcoming 57th birthday. And we're also going to see from her past birthday, but first lady equals 114. She's born on 1 slash 14. Guys, she is a paid TV actor. I cannot stress it enough. This is how you can tell. She's like a coded agent. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh my god well there you have it oh she's a german judge too i mean that's what i'm saying judge 47 i'm sure she's, she's been a lot of propaganda by numbers 47 so we're just going to recap what we saw because this video wasn't about elke bundenbender but i guess it is too because she's here she's at this parade She's at this play, acting. Might as well do Camila, Duchess of Cornwall. You know, she's a culprit in this act. Camila, or Camilla. I don't even know how to pronounce it. Camilla? Probably Camilla, because she's not Spanish, right? Yeah, it's probably Camilla. You know, she's going to die soon. Yeah, I guess she's old. She's going to die soon, I know. But I'm saying so we can look out. But, you know, she, got, she can live to be 93, you know, that's still plenty of time from now. She's 71, Catholic 71, born in 47, <laughs> agent 47, she's an agent for the Zionist Jew Cabal. July 17th. Oh, real quick, I didn't see Bundenbender's birthday of this year. We only did it from her upcoming birthday. And then we'll go to Camila. Instead of just putting it to the side. Like she's not important. She's just as important as a queen. She's another theatrical actor. <laughs> 43 weeks. This is what I'm saying. 43 weeks from her birthday. She's at the Armistice Day Remembrance Ceremony. Armistice equals 43. Armistice Day equals 40. Oh, it doesn't equal 42. There was something else I saw. Look, Armistice Day equals 127. Her name's something. So I don't mean to jump around. Let's just go back to Elke Budenbender real quick, and then we'll start on um, Camilla again. Armistice Day, 127. 80. Elke Budenbender, 127, 80. This is so clear. This is why I emphasize I have never heard of her. It's like, I've never heard of this woman before. She's now being inserted into my mind's eye. And by these numbers, Armistice Day 12780, her name sums to that. Armistice, armistice equals 43. So does killing. 43 weeks from her birthday, she's inside that propaganda acting. Armistice Day equals 127, the 31st prime. That's also 301 days. So. Now we'll go to Camilla, Duchess of Cornwall. You can just do her name, Gematria, see why she's there. Okay. Federal 51. Camilla. And she was born, what, July 17th, 
a 177 propaganda equals 177. That's all she is, an actor inside some propaganda. <laughs> Her name sums to 96. Freemason, 138 like federal. Like Camilla, 138. They keep that over. 13851 like federal. She's an actor for the federal government. They're branding their propaganda. Again, propaganda 177, New World Order 177. July 17th, 1947. Of course, she's born 47. Very special number to Freemasons. See, this is another longer video. Damn it. I can't keep them short. I guess it doesn't matter, though. It's always, as long as we have some information coming out. So, I don't immediately see anything here. I see the span of 299 days, 42 weeks, and 4 days. That's 4224 sequence. So, that tells me then we're going to get something much stronger. From her upcoming birthday. And it's it's the closest birthday, so that's what how they can pack their nice good little numbers in. Exactly. 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 So this actor, Camilla, she is instructed, ordered by her Freemasonic employers to participate and appear at this propaganda event. By the numbers 67 and 26. 67 days from her birthday. She's with the queen. Queen equals 26. Blood sacrifice equals 67. This is why this. she's just standing. Oh, I'm just here. I don't even want to be here. Oh, no, no. Exactly. Because you guys are told to do this. You're paid actors. 67 days. Two months, six days. Blood sacrifice. 67. I'm not sure if I said from her 26th birthday. Excuse me. I meant two months, six days from her birthday. Blood sacrifice, 67. She's 71. Camilla. Queen. In the same method, queen equals 26. Queen, 26. Blood sacrifice, 67. The Duchess of Cornwall. So Cornwall's... Like, why is Cornwall here? Don't... She's a member of the British royal family. That's all, I, that's all I have to say. Whenever you see anyone a member of the British royal family, it means they are a member of this theater troupe. Cornwall, 98, 35, 46, 118. Perfect. Death, 118. Sacrifice, 46. Remember, the 46-second video. We later on get the minute 7 video, a big kill number. Kill, 17. Sacrifice, 170. Kill, 28. 107, the 27th prime. Or, 107, the 28th prime. 103 is the 27th prime. So again, death in the Jewish gematria, sacrifice 46, Cornwall, it's 67 days from her birthday. Also span of 68 days, caskets go 6 feet deep, 8 feet long. Also will be 2 months, 7 days, ritual 27. Unbelievable. So there you have it, I just showed you how the royal family, bunch of actors, bunch of deceivers, the Trump family, the Obama family, a bunch of actors, a bunch of deceivers. British royal family, 96, 222, 111. Royal family equals 137, 33rd prime. 61. I'm sure there'll be, there was probably some propaganda about the royal family yesterday. On the 12th, there was 61 numerology and 16. Royal 71, Camilla, 71 years old, Royal equals 26, like Queen, 64, 28. You know, numbers we've been seeing all up in this property again, this 64 days, from this and that. And I hope I've explained this enough. So, for the recap, just look at this picture. The word pop is wearing black <laughs> on top of all the coding we saw, you know, 67, 26. Plus, kill also equals 26, by the way. Oh my goodness. See, this is bad. I shouldn't have done this. Sophie, Countess of Wessex. It's been so good so far. I can't just skip her now. 
I'm just gonna do all the females. You know, I'm not gonna do Prince Harry, Harry, and then have to do everyone's husband. I mean, it's singular from all of their birthdays. But I'm just saying. Again, I don't. I don't hear these people. I've never seen these people. Camilla, Sophie. I don't think I've ever heard of them. Again, I'm ignorant. I don't know half these people. I don't like the royal family. They've always been a gang of actors to me. Hmm. How you see what? January twentieth, nineteen sixty-five. Oh, we're not gonna do. This is to Camilla's birthday. No, we're gonna do to the Armistice Day. So don't mind what you see here. And it's funny. It's not that I can immediately talk about either. But you notice when we do. <laughs> The, the whatever from the actual things that hap that's happening, it's always easy to see. So Sophie, the wife of Prince Edward, she's 53 years old, the 16th prime, royal 16, or royal family 160. So this is another one where it's synced up perfectly from her upcoming birthday. I'll show you right now, because right now, I see a span of 42 weeks and two days. Four, 42 is satanic cipher, 422. Nine months, 22 days. Reflection of 229. 229 at 50th prime. But let's do for her upcoming birthday. Upcoming 54th birthday. 10 weeks. Oh, here we go. You see? You, you have the pattern you know beforehand. I'm not just making things up and trying to find things that work. I'm, look, from Armistice Day to her upcoming birthday, 10 weeks, one day. 101, the 26th prime. Just like how it was 26 from was it Camille's birthday. Yeah, two months, six days from Camille's birthday. And 10 weeks, one day from Sophie's birthday. Queen equals 26. Royal equals 26. 101 to 26 prime. This is what I'm saying. This is how you do this. You don't just try to find anything out of anything. That's why the people who say that, you can tell that they're mentally retarded because it's clear I don't do that. I'm looking for the numbers 26, you know, 71. So from Sophie's birthday, it's literally 10 weeks, one day, the 26 prime, 71 days. Royal pattern from Sophie's birthday. Never heard of Sophie, but you see now. She's an actor for the federal government. Participating in this propaganda by the numbers. Doing what she's told to do. And with the sun numbers. <laughs> I'm sure her entire marriage, her entire shit was synced up with sun, time. Sophie Helen Reese Jones. Just another theatrical stage performer. You know, they with 40, Masonry 42105. I mean... You have to see any more. It's the numbers for Freemasonry and all these people's birthdays. You know, this is Camila's birthday. Masonry 33, Freemason 96. Now we go to Sophie. Masonry 42, 105. These people are actors for the Freemasons. They're born to be. I mean, th these are royal people. They're obviously born to be. So now you see how the entire royal family, the entire royal bloodline... It's nothing else than a show from the Freemasons. That is what it is. And they're birthed accordingly by the Freemasons, the Zionist Jews. Again, the Jewish Bank of Times married into this royal family, married into all this, the Phoenicians, married into all this. So it's not much to see else there. We know the history. And please, when you can, definitely check out Domino D's comments about Purple, the Phoenicians. You know, and just like on the Big Lebowski, the dude's like, when the rug's gone, he says, oh, well, tied everything together, but that rug's gone, so it thinks a little off. It's likewise the Phoenicians, their presence, their culture. Whenever you see me in my trading videos, guys, that's Phoenician shit. Trading, merchants, controlling all sorts of things, rigging things, manipulating things to get where they want in life. You know, it's all extension of these people. Phoenician 5859, like Freemason. So, sorry that this video is long. I hope that some people do watch my videos in parts if you, you know, you're pressed for time. You can watch it 10 minutes at a time, 5 minutes at a time. You can speed it up. But I had to get all this information out. Talking about all these actors. 
inside this play. You know, Sophie counters the West X. And here's here's what to do. If I've talked a lot, jumped around, all you have to do is go back to this piece of propaganda. I'll link it in the description. And just do from all these people to their birthday. Kate Middleton's birthday, where they did. Megan Markle's birthday, Sophie's birthday. And get the numbers of Royal, for Killing, for Queen. That's all we did. I'm sure Prince Harry's super synced up with this. But I'll, I'll leave him alone. You can do that, you know. I'll keep it to females only to keep it you know, streamlined. But there you have it. This is why you should read People Magazine. This is why you should, if you're trying to code this, this is why people, it's not just some celebrity bullshit. That's what I was thinking. Y'all was biased against it. I was thinking, uh, fuck it. There's more important things to talk about, which there are. But look at this, look at this riddle. Look at this ritual. So clear. I love People Magazine. Really good, really good propaganda from the federal government. Oh, Alexander McQueen code. I mean, come on. She's wearing Alexander McQueen. <laughs> All right. Peace out.